this part. Okay, he ruined it. Dr. Gregory House, please call Dr. Cuddy at extension 3731. This is a good hospital? Depends what you mean by good. I like these chairs. Nine letters, iodine deficiency in children. Cretinism. Baby shows up. Chase tells you that two people exchanged fluids to create this being. I tell you that one stork dropped the little tyke off in a diaper. Are you gonna go with the two or the one? I think your argument is specious. I think your tie is ugly. Why is one simpler than two? Come on, come on, what do you got? Can I have a second to think? No, there's no time to think. Just say the first thing that comes into your head. She's fat. Enough already, okay? We got it. You hate fat people. Are you thinking about taking drugs? Well, think again, because drugs are not the answer. Take it from me, Hank Wigan. Oh, don't remember this ugly mug? I need you to take off your pants. I have a headache. It's my only symptom. I go to see three doctors. The neurologist tells me it's an aneurysm. The immunologist says I got a hay fever. The intensivist can't be bothered, sends me to a shrink who tells me that I'm punishing myself because I want to sleep with my mommy. Maybe you're just not getting enough sleep. This is so bizarre. Not really. We just take Joey's blood out of his body and run it through a pig. So she's really coming back? Who's coming back? You don't know her. You give her a raise? Increase her benefits? Don't have Tebow in this thing, can't rewind. Shut up. You lower her hours? You don't even know her. Who is this guy? He's a patient. He's examining me. He's gotta go back to work as soon as I'm done with the examination. Guess I do too. It's gotta be something. She didn't come back because she likes you. Wait a minute. She did come back because she likes you. <laughs> you dog. You slept with her. Keep talking. I'll finish your exam with a prostate check. I've agreed to take her on one date. What? <laughs> so you into this girl? Yes. No. She's not giving me any choice. Wait. She's making you do her? Date her. Young ingenue doctor falling in love with gruff, older mentor. Her sweet, gentle nature bringing him to a closer, fuller understanding of his wounded heart. Do her. Or you're gay. The house was right. That usually makes you happy. Less work for us. The kid feeds his mum a steady diet of booze, and the problem is too many burgers. The kid's in a tough situation. You do what you gotta do to survive. Never visit a patient. I want that baby. You have a stage four cancer. It's metastasized to your liver. There's a new drug called HC12 that's shown promise in phase two trials. It's your best shot. Thank you, Doctor. You've been so good to me. Well, I, I did publicly bash your company's drug. When I think about how I treated you... Oh, hey, come on. There, there, there. So, um, there is some hope. Always. But just in case, I special ordered an extra jumbo-sized coffin. Hey. Don't thank me. It's just who I am. Hey!
might want to block your ears for this, it's quite loud. You hired a black guy because he had a juvenile record. No, oh, that wasn't a racial thing. I didn't see a black guy, I just saw a doctor with a juvenile record. Can I put my pants back on now? I'd rather you didn't. It's hookers. Oh my God. <laughs> Multiple hookers. But a house is house, right? He's got to have it his way. <laughs> Four or five ways. <laughs> That's <laughs> fucking funny. Be yourself. Cold, uncaring, distant. Please, don't put me on a pedestal. I'm, uh... Do you like monster trucks? I don't know what they are. Right. <laughs> that's funny. No, the monster trucks? How's asking you? That's... That's funny. I was the first person he ran into. He just asked me. I gotta go. Not a very high strung little lab dog. Here, pussy, pussy, pussy. Your people insulted my brother. What? They put Romano in the Parmesan cheese shaker again? Said he was a crackhead or a homo or something. So let's put a nice friendly spin on it. Let's go with he got raped in prison. Sharing needles, budget. Hey! Nobody talks to my brother like this, okay? Fine. No idea how he got it. But he has hepatitis C. We're gonna start him on it. There is one chemical that, if ingested, can cause a person's estrogen level to increase dramatically. What is it? It's called estrogen. You wanna get hit too? That would be quite a trick. He slapped me so hard, his brother turned straight. Hope has full-blown AIDS. But I do not have AIDS. So, how's the kid now? Bile obstruction. She's under observation. She'll be fine. Pediatrician will take all the credit. scored. It's a brave new world, Doc. And we are at the cutting edge. You hired me to get into my pants? I can't believe that, that would shock you. Hey, I got something for you. No. A doc in St. Louis gave him to me for migraine. I'm an addict. I, I can't take that. Even Lola was okay with the morphine. The stuff's just a little stronger. Come on. I will not have sex with you. Not again. Miserable at the first time. But... Tell me, Sumana. Huh? Hey, now look at my hand. Come on. She doesn't speak English. Shh. Ow! Ow. Ah. Ah. Oh, my God. Why no? Take off your clothes. We bred these super bites. They're our babies. And they're all grown up and they got body piercings and a lot of anger. 
What happened to everybody lies? I was lying. Here's to women. You can't live with them. You can't kill them. Tell the neighbors they're stripping in Atlantic City. Damn straight. I never bother to wash new clothes before I wear them. Right. Your wife does. She likes you feeling nice and comfortable. Hey, I'm a man. I don't have time for laundry. I'm saving lives here. No, she doesn't wash them either. We'll lock him in a cage. That should be fine medically. Hey! You know what a hemorrhoid is? No. Well, Google it. House. It must be awkward being treated by a man who used to be involved with your wife. Don't tell me. Tell my friend, Ben Franklin. In the morning, I expect you in my office with your letter of resignation and plans for public apology. Otherwise, I'll destroy you. The truth, I hear voices all the time telling me to do stuff. It's crazy, huh? Oh. You son of a bitch. See what I did there? I said I was sorry. Your fear is 105. If we don't bring it down fast. Foreman, why are you doing this to me? No, please. The surgeon may need to amputate your leg. We may need to remove the leg. We may need to remove the leg. That's as fresh as it gets. But it works for him. He saved hundreds of lives. He is a drug addict who flaunts his addiction and refuses to get treatment. He is a disgrace and an embarrassment to this hospital. I'd go on, but it gets kind of mean, so...